things are happening, child of God, things are happening, things are happening, things are happening. When somebody gets pregnant, this woman says, seven months, she has not been to the doctor. Do you know that there are things that can come up when somebody is pregnant? A lot of... <laughs> Vivian, oh yeah, good morning, good afternoon, or good evening, whatsoever the time may be. God bless you, Mama, for coming on. God bless you. Oh yes, God bless you. Nick. Yes, there's a lot of things that can go on. Only in the United States, I was reading this thing, and the statistic says in a year they have up to 660 deaths from women being pregnant. If this is going on in this place, well developed, the highest medical care you can have, everything and everything. Can you not tell me, thank you, God will bless you. Can you not tell me how these things are happening in the under underdeveloped country, in a country like Nigeria? If America is 660 women dying every year just from, 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 from pregnancy-related issues, can you tell me how many women are dying in Africa, especially in Nigeria, where there is no kind of health care? And this woman says she has not even been to the doctor for once. Child of God, her life is at stake. This is why I took interest in this woman's case. This is why I brought it to us. And this is why I was soliciting funds for her. She has not done no utterance. Huh? She does not even know if the baby is sitting right. She does not even know if the baby is sitting wrong. She does not even know if the baby has a cord tied around, around his neck or her neck. God bless whatever the baby is. She does not know that. She has not been to the doctor. Is that not? I mean, that's, that's just scary. For me, thinking about it, <laughs> it baffles me, child of God. It does baffle me. That is why I brought this woman's case. People, I mean, people get pregnant. They end up with all manners of stuff. People get pregnant. There can be diabetes coming out from being pregnant. People can have hypertension that can go to preeclampsia, that can go to eclampsia, which is the seizure, and the woman will die from it, child of God, if there's no medical attention given at that point in time diabetes people have lost eyes nose legs from being diabetic so this woman needs help instead of condemnation she needs help yeah she's pregnant maybe she didn't use her better judgment but this is the wrong time people that haven't even commented on my post because they saw that post they're writing they go and take birth control you yourself go and take birth control it's in concern why is that your problem? What we're saying now is let her, let us help her to live so she will not die. She's such a young woman and she's such a pretty woman. So why, why does she have to die? Because of lack of uh, uh, medical help. That was why I brought out this post. And so I used this opportunity to thank everyone and everyone and everyone that has in one way or the other helped this girl. God will surely bless you. Some of you sent your prayers. Some of you sent your money. Some of you sent a whole bunch of stuff for her and for her baby. And so I make this video and I just say thank you. I'm actually baffled how people respond. That we have good-hearted people in our society for real, for real. A lot of women. A lot of people are really kind and nice. And they came out to support her in a way that I never thought possible. So God will bless everybody that has supported this woman. God will bless you. And we are praying. We're using her as a point of contact. And we are praying for the people that are pregnant at this point in time. Especially those that do not have money to even go to the hospital. May Jehovah have a mercy. We pray that they will carry their children and they will deliver like the Hebrew women. We stand against every cesarean station. We stand against every, every complications of pregnancy for the people that do not have money to go to the hospital. Even the people that have, you might think you have money until they tell you the problem and your problem is bigger than the money you have. That is why we pray in this morning, this hour for every pregnant woman. May Jehovah have a mercy. May he protect them. May he be their uh, obstetrician. May he be their doctor, primary care, whatsoever they may need. May he supply their needs. He is the God of all impossibilities and there's nothing too hard for him to do. He is the one that says that he will supply our needs according to his riches in glory. And so we are decreeing this morning, whatsoever you may need, even you that is watching me, may Jehovah meet you at the point of your need. In the mighty name of Jesus, amen. We bring forward the Father, in the name of Jesus, let your will, O oh God, Father, your word says that healing is your children's bread. Father, you said you sent your word and we were healed. Jehovah, heal your people. Let your healing hand extend upon your people. Jehovah, we're okay.
Mbe oje niye ya Hey shantere ba 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 Kata manzere de 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 Onaya songongo Nuzo ya e de 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 Hey Ebe chile ke no Apuri miye nini Jiyo babu di ke Ononorwe Ogwa wom gwa gwa wom Christ a gwa wom Ogwa wom to chile ke ogwa la me Ye ona ya chile ke mde bube Chima gwa wom ebi ebi Ogwa wom father Jehovah Any one of us that is sick Father let the rain begin to fall Let your blood Place Father Jehovah, let there be healing from the crown of their head to the two toes of their feet. Father, even me myself, Father, any sickness whatsoever it may be hidden or hidden, no, 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 no. Father, heal your people, heal your people, heal your people, deliver us, mighty one of Israel. Let there be healing, oh God, in the in, in you among your people, in the hospitals, everywhere your people are. Father, heal us and receive all the glory, mighty one of Israel, in the name of Jesus, and to those that are looking for the fruit of the womb. What can't my father do? I decree right now as a child of God, as a servant of God, that you should receive your pregnancy. We are speaking to the wombs. We are speaking to the spermatozoas. We are speaking to the fallopian tubes. Let there be healing among the children of God. Jehovah heal, position, give your people. You said we will not be barren. Therefore, we cast every barrenness to the Sahara Desert right this very minute in the name of Jesus. And we declare that your people will get pregnant. Father, Father they will conceive. And they will carry their own children. Yes, they will not be gone too soon. And they say, why did the person go too soon? And they say, because they were pregnant and they were having the baby and they were bleeding. We cancel every bleeding right now in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, we cancel every complications right now in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Father, have a mercy and let your name be exalted and be lifted up among us, O God. In that name of Jesus, Father, celebration will never lack from our houses, Father, because you are moving and you are moving and you are moving and you are meeting us at the point of our need. We bless your holy name, mighty one of Israel, the one that answered our prayers, be lifted up, O King of glory. In the name of Jesus, amen. May God have mercy on us. May God have mercy on us. So, guys, that is why. I came out and I made this video. Yes, it is for her. It is for the woman. She is pregnant and she does need our help. So to everybody that has helped her, God bless you. Yes, she is. She's carrying a baby, meaning that she is fruitful. So I pray that the same ocean of fruitfulness will transcend from her to everybody. That is to every barren area of our lives. May we receive life. May we receive fruitfulness in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. I am Jesus. Juliana Duro of the Juliana Duro Foundation, you know what we are doing. We go about helping people. Yes, that is what Christ has called us to be. The word of God tells us, First Corinthians, some, some of us he has called into the help ministry. And so we go about helping people. So I tell you, I always say, love God, serve God, and bless humanity. Anybody you can help out there, please do it. Don't say, I don't have money. Me, I don't have it. I don't have, but I'm doing <laughs> Jesus, I'm doing my best to the little that I have. I have to share with somebody. You no know, go, yes. Instead of me to go and buy soda, and somebody out there does not have food to buy rice to feed her children, why can't I use that money and give them? Hmm? I can survive without drinking a soda. Why somebody needs to eat with her family? So yes, some of us. Excuse me. Some of us, we don't want to hear it with our ears, but we don't know that's where the blessings of Jehovah comes from. We don't want to give. We don't know how to. We're not even trying to. When they tell us about giving to help others, we, we, we are repulsive of it. We don't even want to hear it. May Jehovah have mercy on us. That is why some of us are here, pium, 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 chasing prophets around to pray for me, pray for me. Why? Well, meanwhile, that thing is supposed to give to somebody so that the ways will be opened up. The prayer said, often will pray for you. The prayer that a widow will pray for you, my dear, is better than that prayer that you're chasing a prophet around to pray for you. Yes, so... I'm not asking you to give me your money. I said, go out there, find somebody that you can help. Help them. The Lord sees. The Lord knows. The Lord hears. He is the only one. <laughs> Thank you. He is the only one that will reward.
reward you. Oh, he's the only one that sees your heart. He is the only one that can reward all your efforts. So let us be each other's keeper. You know, go, yes, so school is opening up in Nigeria. I'm understanding. Yes, find somebody you can buy a book for. Find somebody you can buy a shoe for. Everything is not prayer, prayer, prayer. There are things that we do that moves the hand of God. Giving is one of them. The Lord wants us to give. He says, what is true Christianity? To give to the poor, to give to the needy, to give to the orphan. Give to the people that don't have that. Hey, Jesus. That is why the word, that is what the word of God says. And his word forever stands firm. He says, whosoever gives to the poor, Proverbs 1970, he gives to whosoever gives to the poor gives to the Lord he is the one that rewards them child of God yes sacrifices does work do not give because you have a lot no you give from the little that you have and let him be God in your life when you give your doors are open when you give you are protected when you, Amara no, how are you Good morning, good afternoon, good evening to you. When you give, good things happen and it comes your way. That is the truth, child of God. So learn to give. The act of giving is an act of life.